thank you for joining us. Today I'll be roasting some delicious acorn squash with a recipe from Simple Recipes, created by Sarah Kessenberger and Kate Merker. Here are the ingredients you'll need. One, acorn squash, two tablespoons of olive oil, some thyme, and some Parmesan cheese. After gathering your ingredients, you're going to want to preheat your oven to 400 degrees. After washing your squash, go ahead and grab your cutting board and knife and begin cutting the squash. First, we're going to start by slicing it down the middle. After cutting it in half, you'll notice that there's a bunch of seeds in there. And all we're going to do is just scoop the seeds. After it looks pretty clean on the inside, we're going to start by peeling it and we're going to get all of the skin off. This might take a while, but just be patient with it and eventually you'll get a hang of it. After your squash is completely peeled and all skinned off, you'll begin cutting them in 3, 4, 7 inch slices to where they look like crescents, just like this. So we'll continue cutting them. And even if you want to leave the skin on, that's perfectly fine. Also, something that you may not know about squash is that it's an excellent source of complex carbohydrates, fiber, antioxidants, potassium, iron, riboflavin, vitamin C, and beta carotene, which is an awesome form of vitamin A. You might not know, but in your diets, you need a lot of different vegetables, and squash is an excellent choice. So once you are done cutting all of your squash, we're going to place it in a bowl so we can coat it and cover it in all of our ingredients. Now at this point, we are done with our cutting board, so we can go ahead and set that to the side. So in our recipe, it calls for two tablespoons of olive oil. which may be easier if you measure out ahead of time just so that you don't have to pour it it calls for eight sprigs of thyme but you can use it sparingly it's really up to your personal choice whether you want it or not and also we can use half of a teaspoon of salt and we also need to add some pepper these ingredients are really up to your choice However you want to season it is your call. And we are going to toss the squash so that all the ingredients are fully coating them. We can have nice, seasoned, delicious acorn squash. So in the end, they'll have a shiny coating, but they'll also be covered in seasoning. After mixing your squash, with all, you're going to put them onto a baking sheet and just separate them out to where they're not overlapping. After you're going to sprinkle Parmesan cheese on them lightly until they are all lightly coated. After your squash is fully coated, we're going to place it in the oven at 400 degrees for 25 to 30 minutes. After your squash has reached a golden brown, take it out of the oven, but don't forget your hot that you don't want to burn yourself. Make sure to allow your squash to cool before enjoying your delicious creation. Thank you for joining us today to learn a new, easy, delicious way to use acorn squash in the kitchen.